Welcome back to my channel, guys. It's your girl, Coco Styles. And on this channel, we talk about beauty, fashion, and lifestyle and styling, guys. But today, I wanted to talk to you about some reasons why you would hate your current style, why you are unsatisfied with your style. So let's jump right into it. And the main reason is you're choosing clothes that do not flatter your body, okay? That is the number one reason. And why? is where we're gonna dig a little bit deeper. And the first why is social media. Social media has people choosing clothes that are trendy and that are being pushed in your face with the media. It doesn't necessarily mean because someone created this item that it's fit for your body. And I don't mean like plus size or anything like that. I mean just like following your vertical lines on your body. And for a person who's slender and who has a straighter body, they should definitely follow their silhouette when it comes to buying clothes. You necessarily may not look good in a body kind dress. So just because you see it on social media doesn't mean that you are supposed to get it, guys. So that is the first thing. The second reason is you have too many options in your wardrobe. Why? Because you've been buying trendy pieces and you do not have style clarity. I did a video on style clarity a while back and if you do not have style clarity when it comes to your personal style, you're going to always struggle with finding things to wear and being happy with your style. So what happens is you buy things that you see on social media, things that your friends have, things on Pinterest, all that good stuff, but it's not really your style. You can pull inspiration from it, but what you need to do is one, figure out what your style is. Have style clarity and it will take you far, guys. The other thing is you try mixing too many pieces together and you, you haven't yet mastered that. So when it comes to mixing clothes, um, styles and textures, it's a great thing to elevate your look. However, if you are not really good at it, start with one piece, something that you've never tried before. Um, and then add something else in it, but you don't want to just start throwing a bunch of things together that don't go mix well together Because it's just not gonna look it's not gonna look good um, Then you won't feel hundred percent confident in it and you guys know confidence is the key when it comes to wearing your clothes and having a personal style The other thing is you are afraid to overdo it what I mean by that is there's some things that you have seen that you want to try but you're afraid to try it so you end up staying stuck in this plain style um, the safe zone uh, and you don't really want to try the new thing right how do we start how do we incorporate that we start with a color maybe one color and then one particular style start adding that in that way you are familiar with your actual clothes that you already have, colors that you already love, and then this one color. You wanna be able to still be comfortable in it every time you start to add something new to your wardrobe, right? So if you are a person who wears new shoes but you wanna start adding in color, add in red. Red is a beautiful color. There's so many variations of it. Um, so choose the, choose the right one, maybe burgundy or something like that, but just start with a color or maybe a particular style or fit of the clothes. And the last thing is you are <laughs> unaware of how you can mix your personal style with your professional look. I like to talk about corporate styling because that's who, those are the women who I cater to. But I do know that a lot of the times that I do speak to women, they are pretty much frustrated with the typical basic workwear. We are in 2022, guys, and we do not have to wear the boring old suit. You should have one, but it doesn't mean that you need to wear it all the time. You can definitely incorporate different styles of blouses, patterns, almost di different skirt uh, styles, different blazer styles, while still looking professional. So in order for you not to hate your current style, just start adding in a few of these little tips um, and try to enhance it and elevate it the best that you can. And you guys know I'm really big on quality, so Make sure you are buying the best quality for your money, and that's it. 
Forever 21, uh, I don't even wanna say H&M, cause you can probably, it's like a hit or miss there. But pay attention to the quality, guys. Take care of your things, take it to the cleaners, a good cleaners, because some of these cleaners, they don't clean your clothes properly. Um, and just, just be mindful of how you're caring for your clothes. That will keep your clothes around for a really long time, especially if you are investing in your essentials for your wardrobe. So that is all I have for today. Just some quick reasons why you would currently hate your style and little quick ways on how you can fix it. Comment below if you have an issue with your current style. You guys know I do personal styling, but I also do free or complimentary consultation so you guys can head over to my actual Instagram and head to my bio and click that or you can go to cocostylesny.com and book it there or you can head over to my blog and chat over there or head over to my Instagram and DM me guys so I will catch you guys in the next one bye